Okay, hello. Um, doing a home sign. This is my um, inspiration right here. So I'm going to make it with just a regular glass that you would get from a picture frame. I'm going to make mine a little bigger. So the first thing I'm going to do is to start out with the glass from the picture frame and then I'm going to map out how I want my letters to go. So I'm just going to take a straight edge and let me try to measure it. Okay. So this might take, actually, you know what? Hold on. In order to make my life easier, I am actually going to trace this on a sheet of paper so I can work with the paper itself and see the spacing before I do anything to the glass. So I just traced it, put that over to the side. Here it is. Okay, so I have 10 inches across and eight inches down, okay? And I have four letters. So each of them is gonna be about two inches. So let's see what we got here. Okay, so I decided to just make myself a template. So I came up with a little template. So I have half inch from here, two inches, half inch, two inch, half inch, two inch, half inch, two inch, okay? So now I'm going to actually do the letters. Okay, so something to this effect. I'm going to tape it down on the back so that it does not move once I start. So once I finish making my template, I taped it to the back of the glass and just started to hot glue the little um, glass fillers following the template. So I tried to go as straight as I possibly could so that you have the H, the O, the M, the E. And that's my progress. And it's coming along really nicely. So this collaboration is being hosted by Sonia of Domestic Diva. Sonia has three channels. She has a DIY channel, a home channel, and a cooking channel. So please go and check her out. Um, Sonia is awesome. She does a lot of farmhouse DIY and decorating and all the things that you see her do in her DIYs. You see how she uses them to beautifully decorate her home. And I absolutely love watching her. She's a sister from Canada. And I absolutely love, love, love to visit Canada. I go there. I used to go there every single year, every Christmas. I have a lot of family that lives there. And um, yeah, I haven't been in a few years since my grandmother passed away. The last time I went back, it was four years ago, and um, yeah, so please go check out Usonia, as well as all the awesome content creators who took part in this particular challenge. I am sure you are going to enjoy this playlist. You are going to absolutely enjoy this process.
And you could do anything with this, you know? You could make your own, uh, maybe a mom sign. You could make peace, you could make happy, love, joy, whatever it is that you want. The sky's the limit. And when you buy these little uh, glass fillers, you get about a thousand of those bad boys not hundreds of them in the little pack. Um, and <clears throat> again, please. Wow, this is so nice. That's your sunset? Uh -huh. So what was your inspiration? Um, While I'm crafting, the boys are painting. Oh, nice. Oh, you are so talented. Keep going, baby. Very yeah. nice. No, no, no. You say you're going to take a break. I'll finish it tomorrow. Just put it so that it can dry. Put it on the table. And look at that. Voila, it's done. So these are sharp edges and now I have to figure out what to do about that. Uh, not sure. So I'm not liking how this looks so I'm going to take them off and do this part again. Also, now I really would love to just do this all along the edges but guess what? Sister girl don't have time for that, so I'm going to take a shortcut and I'm going to use this floral um, wrap. And this is also from Amazon. You get a huge spool of it for very little money. So I'm just going to take a single roll. While I'm working, I like to have a playlist going. Somebody's playlist that I haven't seen. Somebody I'm trying to support so they can get some watch hours or just a playlist of the col a collab that I just participated in. But I did not do that and now I'm almost finished. So just FYI. Just let somebody's playlist run while you're doing something. Maybe a family member, a friend, somebody you're subscribed to. My channel, for example. Just let it run. Because you are supporting that person's channel in a big way. So you know I'm a glam girl, so of course, <laughs> I made a rustic farmhouse um, home sign for one of those Heidi Sample DIY challenges, so I thought, daggone it, once I heard about Sonia's challenge, I can't do the same thing again, it has to be different. And so, when I saw that, I saw, hmm, okay, that will be perfect. So here's my sign, I just got to clean this up and figure out what I'm doing with the back how I'm going to get that I guess technically I could put it back in the picture frame that it came out of right maybe it wouldn't go because of the raised edges all right let me see okay so I'm just trying it out in this picture frame it actually doesn't look bad um, I like it I like to use these Dollar Tree cut out a piece of this.
I hope you enjoyed this video. I certainly enjoyed doing this DIY and I am definitely going to be making more signs because I have a ton of these um, glasses from the picture frame. So uh, please check out the, ch the playlist, check out Sonia's channel and consider joining the family. Like, comment, share and subscribe. Turn on your notification bell. And as always, be blessed.